2 2.0, and welcome back to Tall Trees! I bet you can hear the excitement in my voice as I start another adventure in Tall Trees. I absolutely love this series so, so much. Oh, I love this series so much. Anyways, uh, before we start, I would like to mention that I am so, so sorry for you guys. You guys have been watching my Tall Tree adventures in 30 frames per second, while I zoom around in 60 frames per second. So I fixed that now, so you, not, you, know, you are now seeing 60 frames per second, hopefully. So I am so sorry about the quality of the last episode and the episode before that, but just compared to the first episode of Tall Trees, 30 frames a second was amazing, right? <laughs> but yeah, we now have uh, 60 frames per second, if you look up here in the F3 screen. So, yeah, good. We're ready to go on this new Tall Trees adventure. So if you didn't see the last episode, I am trying to head to a giant white thing on the map. And I'm following a pathway because I think that the pathway led to somewhere besides a tree. Nope, that's the same one I followed. It's sort of hard to tell where you're going in these jungles because it just looks the same everywhere. I'm also about to run out of food. I only have like one steak and one pumpkin pie left. And how do I keep clicking that button? I did that in the last episode too. Uh, it's by my control button is why it does that. So here's a pathway and I think I saw it on the map. So I can't remember from the last episode. But is there something here or not? There's a mysterious pathway. And where does this go to a lovely beach? Oh my gosh, not so lovely. Whoa, what is that? What? It's a giant skeleton skull. No, there's a creeper. No, 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 no. No, run, 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 run. I can't fight in 1.9. Just go. No! How did he not hurt me at all? You hear my scream. I was like, ah. <laughs> okay, so this looks interesting. The skeleton skull, where many great men have lost their lives. Uh, no, this does not sound good. Look how deep that water is as well. What is this? Do I go in here? I guess we should try it out and see what happens. Place your ladders here. So I am supposed to be here. Oh, that's so good. Um, because I have completed the quest. I've got four ladders. Um, so I can go ahead and place them here, I suppose. And we're here. What is this? So we've got an ender chest. I think that's so I could get my stuff from the bank. And tons and tons of stone stuff. Okay, I'm going to be honest. This worries me just a little bit. Um... Let me get eight pieces of stone, and let me make a furnace. Um, I don't have any wood though, do I? Oh, that's annoying. Let me go grab some wood from outside before I come in here, because I want to cook my food. They're giving me swords, and do you know what that probably means? Is a fight. But why would they give me so many stone swords? So let's just make a furnace real quick. Yes, my crafting skills are on point today. And we can uh, place that right there. Let's place some coal in here. Uh, we can just place that many. Place these eight in here. And let's read these books. And I can put away this and this, I suppose, because I don't need that. Chapter two and rules, or chapter three, sorry. I read those wrong. And let's see. Congratulations, you've made it into the giant skull. Yay! Don't know how excited I am about that. Whew. Back in the day, the people of Skeleton Bay used to work in the mine shaft beneath it. But no but one day a TNT explosion caused a big collapse. Uh-oh. Most corridors were damaged or destroyed that day, and many great workers were killed and the survivors decided to fill the skull as a memorial sign. This shaft used to serve as a getaway to tall trees as well, but it is uncertain 
what happened, it is uncertain what happened to the path. It is up to you to discover. Oh my gosh, this is like turning into a horror map or something. So, a t a TNT exploded, killed a bunch of people, and now I want to go in here. Do not place destroy blocks except for monster spawners. Oh, oh that makes me feel so much better. A bunch of wep- I, I don't know, this is- This is making me feel like I should be cautious. I think I should be very cautious. Um, and I'll, I'll keep this healing potion out. That's a good way to be cautious. I'll take these things just in case I need them. Um, that's enough. Probably I'll leave the rest of things. Um, my pork chops are almost done. I'll keep this healing potion out, of course. And oh, I'm ready. I'm about to start off. I'm ready to head off. Let me grab my coal. And here we go. I'm sort of excited, but scared at the same time. It's so dark. Let me place down a torch. I'm glad I bought these torches now. There's a pressure plate. Uh oh gosh, I thought it would feel like spotting mobs or something. Okay. Chapter 3. Going underground. Okay, well, this is very creepy. Very, very creepy, I will say that. Um, I could, I could call this one Horror Map, probably. That's probably what the name of this episode is going to be called. Tall Trees Number Blah Blah Blah, Horror Map. There we go, we've got four pieces of wheat. We can make a piece of bread. Um, my crafting table is up there. Oh, there's one right here. <laughs> I was about to go like, rage, my crafting table is up there. Okay, so we've got a piece of bread. I can just throw out this piece of wheat, I suppose. There we go. Unless it was gonna give me more. I don't know. Hmm. Well, too bad. <laughs> threw it out. So sad. Uh, is there something up here? I don't wanna get stuck in the cobweb. No, there doesn't seem to be anything up there. Okay, let's go down without getting stuck in the cobweb. Good. And is there something down here? Nope, that's blocked off. Okay, I want to light this up a bit because this is pretty scary. Only thing that can make this worse if I had like a blindness potion on right now. Um, I, I'm not allowed to go through here, am I? I don't think so. So, where am I supposed to go? I can work this out. This shouldn't be too hard. Uh, there's a staircase. Can, can I go up here? This is... This is sort of intense. Oh no, this is where I came from. Where am I supposed to be going right now? I'm not seeing anything at all. There's a zombie, there's a zombie. Duh, die. 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 Okay. Oh no, there's another one. Oh my gosh, are we spawning in because it's dark or is it supposed to be? No, 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 no. no. Oh no, oh my gosh, no. No, I'm still gonna die. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. Keep me back. Do not back. Back. Look at me! Master of 1.9! Yes! Look at that! Look at that! Gold boots! Okay, those are almost broken and- Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. I've been pushed all the way back here. My recording stopped and I've been pushed all the way back. I was- Oh, the zombies in the cobweb! The zombies in the cobweb! So how is there this many zombies? I don't understand how this is possible. Ooh. Okay, so what I was gonna say before I was mobbed by zombies is these boots have blast protection. And supposedly, the problem with the mine was a TNT exploded, which is a blast. So that doesn't feel good. Where are all these zombies coming from? Apparently, they're all coming from up there. Where can I even go right now? I have nowhere to go. So let me figure this out and I'll be back in a second. Welcome back guys, so I have figured out two very important things. But before I say that, uh, just FYI, it's been like a week or so, maybe two weeks since I recorded the last clip, so if I don't know too much of what's going on, um, please forgive me. Uh, hold on, let me do some of my vault. Um, okay, so if I've forgotten a little bit of things, uh, please don't kill me in the comment section or something. So, I figured out that there is a mob spawner up here, which is spawning in all the zombies, so let's quickly run away from that. I've also figured out there's a zombie here. <laughs> Oopsie. Uh-oh. 
Uh oh. I can't fight in 1.9. It's so hard. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. 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 I'm being hurt from the side too. No. I can't do this. I'm going to die. No. I am going to respawn in the ship, aren't I? Okay. There are zombies everywhere. This is so ridiculous hard and there's a- No! No, my sword! No, 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 I dropped my sword. Okay, guys, let me take care of these zombies and I'll be right back. Oh, no, this is really, really not going to work out. Oh, my gosh, three mob spawners. Three mob spawners. So what I did was I attempted to record clips um, since last one, but I just kept getting overwhelmed by mobs. So what I've done is... Oh, that is so cute. I'm so sorry, zombies. Okay, so I've dug one block here and all the water flooded out. So now I'm able to- oh no, this is bad. This is really bad. Come on, come on, take it out. Ha ha, they're all stuck over there. So I've mined this block, climbed up there, and as you saw, I just placed torches on the mob spawners. And now, hopefully the zombies won't be able to get me. So what I have, um, thought of, what I think I'm supposed to do next is go this way. Because it looks like there's a door. There's definitely a door. And it looks like that there is some maybe parkour. So, that is what I'm going to be doing. I don't need any of this stone stuff anymore, because, of course, I have all this other stuff. So, let's keep the shovel, because I don't have a shovel, um, or a different type of shovel. So, I think I'm supposed to go through here. I really hope I'm not cheating right now. Let's throw this gunpowder that I got from a creeper in there. And this is a checkpoint. Whoa, I needed that so bad. That's amazing. So, if I die oh no oh this is why they've given me a checkpoint oh it's parkour oh do you guys remember the last episode i'm dead i'm so dead do you guys remember the last episode i just kept failing parkour for like half the episode i believe well i'm burning and i can't jump while i'm burning look how much parkour there is oh this doesn't look i mean too difficult, but of course, uh, this is gonna be extremely hard for someone like me! Oh my gosh, I need a fire resistance potion or something. I'm so dead. Am I gonna survive this? Is my regeneration gonna be enough to survive this? Oh, it's gonna make me so hungry though, isn't it? Okay, I think I'm gonna survive this fire, am I? Oh, that was close, that was close. So it's gonna be... W control space. Yes, I hopped there. Uh oh. No, I'm being shot. I'm being shot. I'm being shot. What? How am I supposed to do this? What? No. Eat quickly, quickly. This what? No, this is impossible. I refuse to believe that doing this is possible. Seriously? There's skeletons while I'm doing parkour and stuff? This is impossible. Okay, I need to empty out my inventory once again because I'm so crazy that I just went back and picked up all of the useless stuff that I threw out. But what if I like break through this wall? Because it said I could destroy mob spawners. So where is the mob spawner exactly? Oh my gosh. Uh, skeletons. Skeletons. Quickly take them out. Take them out. Take them out. Take them out. Yes, they didn't do too much damage. Quickly find the mob spawners. Here they are. Uh, torch. No, no, no. On it. There has to be a torch on it. And the other one. The other one. There we go. So I've stopped the skeletons from spawning. Uh, that is really good. And it looks like they're stepping on the pressure plate as well. Whew. This is a bit dangerous. Get in the lava. Okay. Didn't exactly go in the lava. But at least he's dead. Okay. Now we can hopefully do this parkour. So I think I was supposed to do was like um, speed parkour, I think. So I do have some blocks if I am forced to cheat. But they're all one block jumps. I really don't. I hope that I don't have to cheat. Uh, I really do hope I, uh, or wish I had a fire resistance potion though. Because uh, this is pretty bad. So, I'm. Tr can I. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Luckily, there's a checkpoint. Yeah, the checkpoint worked. If that checkpoint didn't work, uh, I would be pretty upset. Okay, so there we go. We've nailed our first jump. Well, I wouldn't call it nail. I almost walked over it. But um, there we go. Second jump. Oh, I have to be so, so, so careful here. W control space. No, 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 no. I've gotten to here. This is like the farthest I've gotten. Okay, okay. Um, don't, don't, don't kill me. Uh, I don't think it's gonna kill me, but I need to be very careful on this next jump, don't I? And that would be most of my food gone. 
So I definitely need to start being careful. I mean, I've got a little bit more food in my inventory. I'm so sorry if I'm bad at commentary. Um, you know what? Here, let's just speed this clip up because I ain't gonna fail this so much. So here we go. Time lapse of me failing this parkour. Go! <laughs> Oh my gosh, I finally made it, and then it looked like I was gonna burn to death at the last second, too. So, I cheated a little bit, but when I finally got to here, I did it like a pro. I was amazing. I'm so glad you guys got to see that, and I didn't stop recording. At these end jumps, I made it, it was amazing. I ended up doing so well after messing up on the super easy jumps. So I realized that the sprint, you don't have to press control either, so you just double tap W. So yeah, I figured out, um, like, stuff like that, some helpful hints, and uh, hopefully that won't take too, um, long for you guys. Hopefully that was a pretty fast time lapse. No, no, no more parkour, please. It gave me another checkpoint. Um, that sort of worries me that there's gonna be more parkour. Uh, let's go over here and see... Like, is this just the other end to where we were? Uh, yes, we were over there to begin with. Let's go over here. There's a, another checkpoint. Um, so there must be something through there. So let's go back this way and just check to see if there's anything. I know there's a skeleton there. Um, I'm sort of ignoring him for the second. Let's go through here. Uh, there's a chest. Oh, we've got more torches. And what did I see? I see an enchanted bow. Seriously, Bane of Arthropods, <laughs> the Black Widow, I get it, Bane of Arthropods, uh oh, quickly, torch, 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 this guy, no, I was gonna say he was, he was ignoring me, but uh, he's not ignoring me anymore, why are all those zombies wearing boots, I already have gold boots from a zombie, <laughs> okay, so that's one way, oh, there's more mob spawners, no, wait, what, no, that's where I came from, is that all this this way, seriously? So I didn't go the right way in the beginning, right? Oh, the skeleton's gonna ping me. Quickly, sprint, sprint. Don't wanna get hit by the skeleton. Go, 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 go. Through here, click the checkpoint. And what's up? Is it? What is this? Um. Oh my gosh. Well, that was violent, wasn't it? Oh. <laughs> uh, I sort of, um. Oh no. Oh no, I broke the redstone. Well, luckily it's still connected over here. Oopsie, didn't mean to do that.
that. Oh, if you survive, there's a way to climb back up. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Let's, um, avoid the pressure plates, I guess. Uh, maybe that is a smarter idea. So let's go, oh, sort of the jump, I guess. Like that. Uh-oh. No, no, please, no, please, no, no. Can I just go? Oh, I'm so dead. I am so dead. I'm sorry if I'm so bad at commentary at moments like this. It's because, like, um, uh, I'm trying to concentrate. Let's just sprint across. No! I'm gonna die again. I just... I don't know if I'm able to do this. There's just some things on computer that I just can't do because I normally play Xbox. So, uh, yeah, like accidentally opening my inventory while getting bombarded by fire arrows. That's one of those, um, moments that I shouldn't have. So, you ready for this? Ready, go! Ha ha! Take that, arrow dispensers! Take that! So that's another way to beat things. Let's quickly get this checkpoint before I die somehow. Did that shut the door on me too? <laughs> that's hilarious. Okay, so, whoa, so many arrows. Well, I don't need this many arrows actually, so um, let's just uh, get rid of a few stacks of these. And now, what's this? What did that, what did that do? What? It, it what? Oh, it's a puzzle, it's this, Parts like a bunch of puzzles. Okay, minecart control room. I must say, when I went down in this spooky horror map cave, I was not expecting a puzzle map. <laughs> I will say that. So, I guess I can do one more of these puzzles and then I will have to end this video because it is going on quite a long time. I know some of the previous episodes have been like really long, so I guess this might not be too long in comparison. Minecart control room. Uh, lead the cart to the other end of the room. You only have three chances. So, in this puzzle, you must get the minecart to the other side of the room. Set the levers correctly, then hit the button. Each cart represents one chance. Only use one cart as at a time. So, I need to make it so that this minecart gets to there? Or is the minecart coming from there? I don't know, but I guess the tracks have to be connected anyways. So this shouldn't be too hard, I say. And then we should just connect that, right? That should work. Uh, first cart. Oh, so it goes from there? It goes over here? Oh, okay, okay. Now I'm seeing, because I didn't really know which side it was going to come from. This should... In theory work because it went all the way over to there so that's like the last track I have a chance to do that worked right oh good that worked yay that was so simple oopsie shouldn't have said that I did not realize that this was going to oh my gosh do I have to do I still do I have one chance left is that what it means oh this is gonna be terrible so this changes this one in the front, I think. Okay, so it's going that way because this ends. And then where does it go from there? It comes over to here somewhere. And then what's this change? No, I don't think it needs to go there. I think that's correct. Is it going to send the minecart? Uh-oh. That didn't go the right way, did it? Ended up over there. How did that happen? Did this affect it? No, I, that seems to be correct. What about this? What? I am so confused. How did the minecart get over there? Let me just not cheat, but uh, see what happened. Is there a switch for that, though? What is going on? Oh my gosh, that's so sneaky. How was I supposed to see that? It's supposed to like go around here and land back there, I guess? And then go around through there? Or it's just this is supposed to turn there. Okay, so sorry I had to break the glass. I just couldn't see, and that's probably the point. So there we go. Now I can see that this track goes under here and to there. And then where does it go from here? 
I think that's all correct. So let's try this again. Is it gonna send another cart or do I need to like place the cart back down? Yeah, I think that's um, what I need to do. So let's just take this mine cart. Uh, we don't, do we need the hopper in it? Well, I guess I'll put it in there anyways. Oh, I see, that's so cool. So it came from there and now it's here. So let's place the, oh, I need to craft it. I don't think the hopper will matter, will it? I don't think so. It doesn't seem to be doing anything. So let's get rid of the hopper. Don't know why it had to be minecart with hopper. Hopefully it doesn't. And then I can go into the control room or I could if I had any blocks to pile up with. So let's get out some wood. Well, not get out, but craft some wood planks. And hopefully it'll work this time. So where can I go? Uh, there's a cobweb there. So let's eh, place that there. Let me place this here. And go to here. And that sets off the minecart. And wait, where did it go this time? Did it go to the other side of the room? Or did it get stuck? I am so confused right now. What's wrong? What? How did that not work? Is it because I put wood there? Is that what the issue was? Maybe I should not put wood there and see what happens? Uh, okay, let's get this minecart back out. Sorry if I'm, of course, like I said earlier, bad at commentary because I'm trying to concentrate, of course. I have to figure out what the puzzle is. So, everything seems to be correct. I j what else can I do? Press if I think it's correct. Is it just not going far enough? Is that the issue? Because I don't see another way to do this. Because it, this track does not connect to there. So that's the only track that connects is there. So it has to be here. So maybe I just need to push it? What? I, d I am so confused, guys. Um, did that go to the end? I can't even tell. Let's go. No, it obviously didn't go to the end. Where is it now? I just think they didn't have enough power rails, I think is the issue. Can we get it up there? There we go. So it's gone to there. I have no idea if I'm cheating or if there was just wasn't enough power rails. Because it's gone to the end now and the track was all correct. So I'm just gonna assume that I was, or that they they were just wrong, like with the amount of power rails, possibly. Okay, bonus: position your remaining carts in the TNT slots before letting your last cart finish. Use only one cart at a time. Again, hit when you are ready. Bon. Um. What? Okay. So I need to. Get the cart to there, maybe? Oh, that's interesting. So I would need... Okay, so this will cover the first slot. So let's hit that. And it's hit the first TNT slot. And then I need to make that go to there. And that'll go to the next TNT slot. And then there was one more minecart that they gave me, like, in that hopper. Or that chest. So I can use that... For my last one. So this should spawn in one here. It should go all the way across to the end. And should go to the next room. I can hit this button. I'll have to go in there and push it, I think. Or not. It actually worked this time. So it was supposed to work like that. And now this should have... Oh, yeah, I need to hit it. I was like, why didn't it hit the TNT? So there we go. It's hit the next TNT slot. And now we can take this minecart and put that... In here, <laughs> quickly break this and place it there. Run over, ouch, 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 uh, pile up. Like, come on, place block. And, oops, wait, I almost hit it, but we need to position it. So it needs to go this way, and then this one doesn't matter, right? I think that should finish it. Let's go ahead and see. It's gonna go around there, and it's stuck. Of course it is. <laughs> Little 2D house, is, that's cute. There's emeralds in there. Why is there emeralds in there? And also, how is this supposed to work? Like, seriously. Go through, cart. Oh. I see. It's a minecart with hopper, so it was supposed to pick up those emeralds. 
Well, that makes sense. Um, so I think I just collected my reward. That's, um, <laughs> oops. Yep, it's definitely, yeah, oops. Did not mean to do that. Also, I don't know if you noticed a long time ago, I had to cheat myself in some steak. But anyways, this has been a super duper long episode. So, yeah, I just had no good position to end, really. So, hopefully you guys did enjoy the really long episode. I know most of you guys do. Unfortunately, it does take up a lot of your time. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And, um, hopefully I'll see you in the next Tall Trees. Bye!